the most important thing the point i want to make tonight is this that it is extremely important for muslims to be able to convey to people living in western countries that there is no correlation between islam and terrorism unfortunately through a planned campaign islam and terrorism have been linked and 1.3 billion muslims are on the back foot on the defensive trying to justify that islam has nothing to do with terrorism and what the point you need to make is this that according to the holy quran 124000 messengers of god were sent on earth all of them with one message and the message was that the almighty wanted us to be human beings rather than intelligent animals animals believe in might is right survival of the fittest whereas human beings have compassion and justice and muslims was supposed to be and should be the community that is, that should be compassionate and that should believe in justice just like every messenger of god to every human community brought the same message so when something like 911 happens we should be able to tell those people who blamed 1.3 billion people for the acts of 18 people that terrorism knows no religion all religions preach the same thing and unfortunately we do not have either the political or intellectual leadership in the muslim world to be able to convey our point of view so we have things we have words like islam of fascism like we all know that islam believes in plurality muslims have lived with other religions we have lived with hindus we have lived with buddhists we have lived with jews christians we accept as the quran says allah says in the quran that it is through his will that we are distributed in different communities it is through allah's will that human beings are different different distributed in different religions and communities and allah goes on to say that had he wanted we would all, all become one community and then it goes on to say the ayat goes on to say compete in being good human being so we have a religion which preaches plurality we accept other religions no way does allah tell us to convert everyone to one one mono culture or mono time we should make them understand that islam like all great religions all great revealed religions of of the almighty allah want justice on the earth want peace want compassion islam makes us into human beings the best aspects of a human being nobility generosity selflessness is what our religion teaches us as opposed to being simply intelligent human beings where we only think of us where nothing is ever enough where we worship the material god where we just seen this collapse of the banks where you saw the ultimate greed human greed where poor people's savings were robbed by the few rich people this is what islam and all great religions preach against they want us to be human to think of the poor to, to think of the underprivileged to be just to tell the truth in other words everything noble about a human being is and i also feel that inshallah the time is coming where in the muslim world we should have democracies rather than dictators and kings running muslim countries who do not represent the muslim public opinion and because they do not represent the muslim public opinion we have puppets sitting there who are manipulated by superpowers for their own ends as is unfortunately is happening in pakistan where a puppet is making our own army kill our own people in the name of war of war on terror whereas in fact it has become a war of terror Thank you very much.